Hey y'all, and welcome to part 34 of my Crystal LP. This is Toru Imahara here, and I have Gojira out here first, because I figured why not, and I gave Shurunui the charcoal once more, and I gave Gojira the amulet coin, because that way, you know, I get more money. And, you know, I went ahead into this item storage and stored that PP up that we found and the uh, pink bow that the nice lady gave us. Because, you know, it could be useful. I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe. So, you know, just... It could be useful. You never know. You never know. So now we are going to fly to where we need to go next, which is Mahogany Town. Or at least we need to go to this area next. So what we want to do here is, yay, this is finally fixed. Okay, once you've done the rocket side quest, the real people who, uh, you know, own this place will come back. And let's see if they have one revive and one hyper potion. That would be nice if they did. Let's see here. They have a hyper potion. Do they have revives? Yes, they do. Perfect. So we are buying one revive and one hyper potion here. So this is great. I don't think they have full heals here, but I'll take it. Awesome, so we got to do that before heading off to our next city. Which is Blackthorn, as I've said before. So what we do is, from Mahogany Town, you go east. So this is Route 44, so there's bound to be new Pokemon here. So let's find out what those are. Uh, we are here. So sorry if there's a bad screen view, but... Let's find out about the new Poke Dudes. I don't care about that. We just beat them because we're awesome. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, uh, that we're doing later and probably, you know. Wait, where's Route 44? Oh, that is Route 40. Oh, no, the, there's Route 44. See, I'm not crazy. So, new Pokemon are Licky Tongue and Tangela. Uh, that's an evolution, evolution. <laughs> not crazy? Yes. Well, I might be slightly crazy. I don't know. So this area right here, I'm going to be switching between Bulbapedia and this and the game <laughs> because, uh, yeah, this does not look fun and I suck with directions as I've said many times before. So that guy right over there is a potentially optional trainer if you have ninja skills. So up here is, let's find out, a burnt berry. So I've already gone over what a burnt berry does, but in case you forgot, it heals frozen. So that's very nice for us. Hmm. If you go this way, let's see what we can find if you go this way. There's an optional trainer who's going to be done off screen because you have to talk to him in order for him to battle you. And, ah, tur trainer that turns, trainer that turns. Da -da 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 okay, getting the item. And we have found an Ultra Ball. Awesome. Uh, no, no other items. So, optional trainer done off screen because I ninja skilled him. Barely, but I did. So, we've just gone around probably trainers you're supposed to fight. So, yeah, optional trainer done off screen. See if there's not an item here. There's not. Sadly, now you know there's no items. So, another optional trainer done off screen because I ninja skilled her. Uh, optional trainer done off screen because, yeah, he you have to talk to him. So, now we're going to try and get this item without this third seeing us. So, we have found a max repel. This will, is the best repel in the game. It will repel Pokemon for the most amount of steps. However, I like super repels better because they're cheaper. So, he's not seeing us. Oh, crap. I hate people who turn dead. Trat. Optional trainer shown on screen. I'm sorry, people. So this is Psychic Phil, who wants to battle here. And apparently he forgets we have two things that will just make him crap. We have Bite and we have Ice Punch. So both of these, those moves will work on this guy, because this guy is a Psychic Flying type. So yeah. <coughs> Both of you use Kadabra, why would we? And we are going to bite you again. Cause, yeah, we can. We're awesome like that. Super effective, done. More experience. <coughs> so, that guy is done. Okay. 
So our mom is buying us, let's see here, a doll. Unfortunately, another unhelpful item. So I don't know if you can give any of these trainers your number and they'll like give you something useful because, you know, I usually don't talk to people. Yeah, I don't want you to say me. Yes! Ninja skills. Okay. So let's see here. Next we went to go this this way. That is hmm. Suspicious? No, no suspiciousness. Uh there's an optional trainer right there if you just go like that. See if there's an item near here. Uh Route 44 Ice Path. Well, yeah. Hmm, let's see here. If we go like this, it becomes an optional trainer. Yes. Okay. So as I said, I'm going to be switching between Bulbapedia and the game for this area because I got no sense of direction. So this is the ice path. Before we go any further in this area, we are going to our pack and using one of our 38 super propels. And actually, before we use that, let's use the dang max propel that we got that we're not even going to buy. So yeah, we're, we're going to use that first. So we don't waste our uh, super repels because they're awesome, but we only have 38. I mean, that should be more than enough, but as I said before, I have no sense of direction. So thankfully, first area is very simple. You just, you know, go like that and go around and around. This is where it starts to get complicated. So that's a... Uh, and this is the first puzzle! So obviously you have to go <laughs> up first, but I have no idea what the rest of the solution is. So Bobopedia away! So Bobopedia says on the first floor, first ice patch is up, left, up. So we have already gone up, so up, left, up. And then what does it say? Unless if... Nope, sorry for the banger. Uh, and then left, down, left, left, down, left. I will admit, when I first played through this, I did use Bulbapedia for these areas. And, uh, dang, can I, like, minimize you or something? Uh, no, 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 no. Back, 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 back. Uh, sorry about that, people. I overspammed the button. There we go. I don't care about that. Oh, wait, 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 wait. There are new Pokemon here. I need to show you guys this. Let's see here. Let's go over everyone while we have the time. And actually, you know what? We'll just cover all the available Pokemon now. And we will cover the rest of the ice cave in the next episode, okay? So, new Pokemon you can find here in the ice path. So you can find Swinum and Delibird. Those two are new Delibird stinks, by the way. Jinx is new. Ice Psychic. Let's see here, Sneasel's new. He's a dark ice, but doesn't become really good until later. Uh, show you. And that's it. There's no really new people besides, you know, Delibird, Jinx, and Sneasel. So yeah, that's all you can find here in the ice path, and we will come back in the next episode having fought all those optional trainers I showed y'all earlier, and uh, also after, you know, healing up, and unfortunately for us, we have just wasted that max repel. So I might, you know, go to uh, Olivine City and spend all the money I have right now on a ton of super repel, so we will be nice and stocked for this area. Because, uh, yeah, we're going to need him. So, uh, in the next part, uh, we are going to take on the ice path. And also, I'm just going to, like, write down all the solutions on, like, a little piece of paper or something. So I don't have to switch between Bulbapedia and the game every five seconds. So that way, it's a lot smoother for the LP. And it just is nicer for y'all. So I will see y'all in episode... 35. I hope y'all have a nice day. TTFN. Tata for now.